a moment. Guys, just gonna share this on Discord server. In so that, and then we'll get to the movie that I watched a week ago. I um, did not watch it yesterday like I normally do with these, but at least I'm finally back here and streaming, which is good. So, we're almost done. This link. No more. Alrighty, link is posted in Discord servers, so let's get to it. I'll pull the stream up here on my phone. That's there. And now we should be good. Get pulled up. Boom. Alright, we have one viewer on, and they're gone. Okay, and that out. So I watched this a week ago. We're down towards the end. We're nearing the end of our Superman movies. We've got Superman 4, The Quest for Peace, Superman Returns, and Man of Steel. And then we'll rank those in that series of films. So I'll try to remember as much as I can from last week when I watched it. It was... It definitely takes because the first two Superman movies were very with their tone and everything, and then it just kind of, this one just kind of went, throw that out the window. We're going to be goofy and everything now. And it's, I appreciate it, honestly, for a goofy Superman movie because... I've watched Man of Steel like once or twice and it's kind of very serious, but we're, it's, I enjoy it. The jokes are pretty good. I don't remember any at all, really. It's kind of physical comedy, so you don't really remember. Our, our, um, for some reason, the, I don't understand why our plot is this, but it's a man who is really good with computers, and Lex Luthor is not in this movie at all, if I recall correctly. It's another big billionaire guy, not Bruce Wayne, they didn't do that. Some other big billionaire guy who, want, who starts by, um, he like gets, he wants to basically end other people's things of like he just wants to like my brain trying to remember this from a week ago he just wants more money he wants to make more money and so he when he finds out that this guy is really good with computers and everything he hires him yeah I don't know about Outcast. It might have been I haven't watched it very recently, but we'll get the, we'll get to Man of Steel when we get there. This one is pretty good, honestly. Um, I was this guy to literally take over a satellite and then use that satellite to um control the weather in certain areas so then he can so then the crops that they have over there aren't good and then he can 
all about the money. It's, a, it's all about the money, money, money. I don't know what that was. But our huge thing. And Superman interferes the first time. So he tries to figure out a way to kill him. So, kryptonite. They try to manufacturally make kryptonite. And it doesn't work, but... And we... Lois Lane gets sidelined vacation, so that's something during this movie. Lois Lane's on vacation. And we get Jimmy Olsen. And to replace Lois is Clark's ch um, high school friend, Lana Lang, who I'm pretty sure has been in other Superman media and the stuff, but this is the first time I've kind of heard of Lana Lang, so yeah. She's in it, and so he's... As Superman, he goes to the town where they lived, which was Smallville, and while he's there, they just want to give him the key to the city. Big big brain moves here. Give Superman the key to the, your city. Big brain moves. And while he's there, um, the smart guy, smart boy computer guy, shows up, and gives him the manufactured kryptonite, which doesn't affect him at all until later on. And it acts as red kryptonite, basically, where it turns him bad for like 24 hours. That's how it worked. That's how it did. It. they did it, basically. He was a parpizza? No, he fixed that. It's no longer the Leaning Tower of Pizza, it's just Tower of Pizza. He just did that. Our pizza? No, he fixed that. It's no longer the Leaning Tower of Pizza. It's just Tower of Pizza. He just did that. And he got drunk for some reason. Bar. Drinking and I'm just like, now we get drunk Superman. Give us drunk Superman flying now, please. He leaves the bar and goes flying and I'm like, Superman. What every kid wanted to see back in the 80s. A flying drunk Superman. It's... It's fine. Flying drunk Superman. I just don't know really what it was. And then he stops at a... He stops at a stinking... Tr trash site. Whatever. I'm trying to think of what they're called. Whatever. Basically where they just dump trash. Like a landfill. And... Like, somehow, it, like, Clark, you have Superman, but it's like in Superman 2 when he lost, when he let his powers, but what was about the money? Arthur Morgan. I don't get the reference outcast. I don't know. Oh, what uh, about the money? I don't know what was about the money. And he, it's like Superman 2 where he, gives up his powers like Superman and Clark can't separate themselves like physically and mentally can they just fight and somehow Superman doesn't just smash him to a smithereens it doesn't make sense because uh, he because Superman punches Clark really hard during this fight and he does not get hurt. How is it that you don't die from being punched by Superman? And yes, Clark Kent is Superman and everything, but in the context of the movie, it still doesn't really make sense. But yeah, I don't know. But yeah, <laughs> getting punched and beaten and thrown and stuff. He gets thrown in one of those machines that just smushes stuff into a, like a cube. He just, Clark gets thrown into those things and survives. One thing that was funny, he grabs a bunch of tires and tosses them on top of Superman where it's just stuck, where he's stuck. Frame rate, big poopy. Yes, frame rate, drop Big, big poopy. I don't have the best of Wi-Fi connections where I'm at right now. But 
you make do with what you got. So, yeah. We'll get up in frame rates definitely at some point. But, yeah. And literally, he's just stuck standing there, arms stuck to him and everything. And the, um, the stinking tires are on him, and it doesn't do anything. Literally, he just breaks out of them, and I'm like, why, why did Clark even try doing that anyways? And I don't even remember how he managed to survive it. I'll go and look this up real quick and see how he managed to survive it, if I can find a clip of it. So, let's search YouTube and look it up. <clears throat> I just burped, sorry. It's like 4.13 where I am and I had lunch three hours ago. Mike's Famous Philly and it was delicious. I really loved it. And then we had ice cream from Brahms. I had a candy bar mix of chocolate frozen yogurt and Butterfinger and that was delicious. I'm just telling you my lunch right now while I try and look this clip up. Let me see. Superman V Superman Super Superman 3. <laughs> this is very wonderful. Superman three times in a sentence. Oh, who knew you could do that? Okay. Superman vs. Clark Kent. Yeah, that is, this is the clip. Let me go over here. Switch to screen and webcam. So I decided. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to show you guys these. So, yeah. I kind of... If I were to watch a Superman movie again, this would probably be the one... For now, this would probably be the one I'd rewatch for now. But I've heard Superman 4, The Quest for Peace, is really bad. And I'll still watch it for next week. So, yeah. Um, hope you, the few who stopped by, Number One Outcast and Shadow Camille, um, go hang out. Shadow Camille actually has a channel called The, um, the, Mad Astral Mech, so go check that one out. And if you know who the Astral Mech here on YouTube is, go check him out. And that's oh, let's see. wait, so Superman choked Superman to fly away, Superman. Yeah, that's how things work here, at least back in the 80s with these movies. So, yeah, go to Outcast channel, go to Shao Camille's channel, go to the Mad Astral Mech channel, go to the Astral Mech channel. Go hang out with those guys in their discords. Also, while you're here, join my discord. Link in the description. It never expires and has unlimited uses. So there you go. And, um, yeah. Also, if you enjoyed this stream with the amount of frame drops that happened, though. Sorry. That's my fault. I'm not good at streaming, really. But, it, it I'd make do with what I have. So, yeah. Subscribe share with your friends, hit that O, oh, yeah, um, that's about all, I think, we're good here, next week we get another stream, my videos are actually better quality than this, this is on my laptop, which it has, surprisingly, has worse than what my, um, phone has, yeah, no problem, Camille, you're welcome for the shadow, goodbye, folks, See you later. See you next week on the next Saturday stream. I will be, I will not on July 24th, the weekend, the, sh the Saturday of the 24th of July, because I'll be in Branson, Missouri with my grandparents. Maybe I'll make a video out of that. Frame big, frame rate big.